chicken finger restaurant, but like, hello. <laughs> but like, pretty good. And they have crinkle fries with the paprika seasoning. Ooh, mm -hmm. that sounds really tasty. Like Zaxby's, but like a ripoff. A ripoff Zaxby's? Yeah. So it's a Raxby's? Flaxby's, like a fake Flaxby? Zaxby's. Oh, a fake Zaxby's, Flaxby's. I like it. Faxby's. Faxby's. Send me a Faxby. <laughs> what is going on? The goal of today is to get so many cool things. We're, th we're thrifting, um, which I've never done before. So I'm brand new at this. And I didn't know you had never been I've thrifting. never been. I mean, I've been to thrift stores, but I don't think I've ever been thrifting. When, when, when I've been, it's like, okay, I need a new outfit for That's whatever. That's embarrassing. I can't believe we've been dating for six months and you have never been thrifting. Dating for six months and no thrifting. But the plan is to get some cool stuff, some really amazing stuff. Um, I need a new summer wardrobe. Uh, filled with all the high high summer fashions um, because I'm all about some fashions and we're starting here at a little place called Dress Up. Basically, I'm already in love with the dresses. This is not thrifting yet. Oh, this is not thrifting yet. We're just shopping. <laughs> <laughs> I'm annoyed. Dress didn't fit. Wasn't in my size. Couldn't even get my arms through the sleeves. Friggin' ridiculous. Dress up. Guess it's only... Really, it's a woman's store, but I don't know. They gave me funny looks and told me not to record. That's a lie. I was a too embarrassed to record. But also, there was copyrighted music. That's why I didn't do it. I'll, I'll film anywhere, anything, anytime. But yeah, nothing fit. Allison got some stuff, though. Whatever. Now we're gonna go thrifting. I think it was you at the McDonald's, I'm gonna help you. Hi, can I please just get two large Diet Cokes? No, that be all for you? That's all. Two twelve and a window for you. Thank you. No problem. I got two twelve. Oh, shoot. Oh, shoot. I'm ready. Thank you. <laughs> Thanks. You too. Look at that. We got it from the second window, not the third window where it says pick up here. Because that guy was like, customer service is my middle name. It's will it, we, we will find things get it get it got it good will okay is it cute yeah that's kind of cute shoot first time i've found good successes oh and obviously the big camo jumper overalls that's what I'm getting. And that shirt, clearly. <laughs> ah. <laughs> Found a whole bunch of shorts because uh, at the moment I pretty much exclusively wear gym shorts everywhere. Uh, so that needs to change because it just does. Okay, so we're gonna see if any of these work. Not, not quite, I mean, they're nice, but not... Yeah. <laughs> what am I doing? <sighs> these are, uh, these are painted on. Wow. They are so tight. Oh my gosh. <laughs> they're, they're way too tight. Oh my gosh. Dang. Okay, okay. It's the first pair that almost fits. Boom! I don't know what I'm doing. But it's like, I mean, it looks a little weird, but I don't know. I don't know. I don't ever go shopping. What am I doing? <laughs> okay, I actually really like these ones. They're just ever so slightly tight. But I feel like, I feel like once I finish my summer cut, they, they might fit. And I love red, so. That'd be cool. Okay, these, these, these ones are good. Mission accomplished. We did it. We yeah. got, we got lots of things. Um, you didn't get the Dora Explorer jacket that we started the video with. It looked like, you know, an Explorer jacket. Uh, but I got some shorts, some, I did of course buy more gym shorts because you can never have too many pairs of gym shorts, but I did get some fancy shorts, mm -hmm. some fancy pantsy shorts. Um, <laughs> And you got some shorts and a dress. Basically, it was the best thing today. Um, it's pretty dope. It's pretty, pretty dope. 
What's the plan now? Another goodwill. Another one. Guys, it's thrifting. It's thrifting. Plural, multiple, cation tables. Here we go. Refueling station number two, which which? Sandwich time. I love Reuben. I just noticed they had a Reuben. Reuben is like my standard go-to sandwich. Like if I want to test, if I want to test if a pub is a good a pub or not, I eat their Reuben. And then that's what I go to pubs. I'm cool. Oh, do I do occasionally, uh, but I test. I eat the Reuben and see if it's a good pub. And so we're about to find out. Oh my gosh! Look how thick this is. Yo. Okay, looking pretty good. Taste test number one. Here we go. Oh, the bread's all soggy. Ugh, that's not a. I don't like that. Ah. Uh, mm. Okay. Out of ten, it's like a four. I wouldn't get a Reuben here. So. Now you know. Always find me at the gym equipment. Goodwill number two is proving to be a little bit of a bust. But I warned you about this one. Yeah, she said this wasn't was very good. But never fear. Dancing. We're not giving up until we find something. Dancing dice. Dancing dice. Found it. Please. Let's go. Oh Game of a lifetime. The game of a generation. It defined the 70s, Dancing Dice. History books won't tell you that, but it did. You know who won us World War III? Or World War II? The inventor of Dancing Dice, Mayor Games Incorporated. So, fun fact, write that in your textbooks. Good one number two is a bust. Then of course we had to go to Target, because that's what you do. Uh, and now, final stop of the day, Starbucks. Gotta have the coffee, the coffee. You can never not be fueled up enough because after this, got to go to the gym because uh, you got to do that. But it's been, thrifting was an experience and a half. I think on a scale of funness, I would put thrifting, um, it's definitely not like running for your life type of fun because that's just, I don't know, that adrenaline spike is hard to beat. But it's definitely a lot more fun than, you know, like sitting around doing nothing. So I think I'm going to put it in... Um, it's just above crashing a kid's party at a Chuck E. Cheese and just below Grand Theft Auto. So I think it, right in that sweet spot, right where it's like just the right amount of legal fun. I think that's where thrifting falls. So if you're on the fence about it, I highly recommend it. Um, check it out. You know, if you got some friends you want to go with, that always makes it fun. Uh, or you can go by yourself. It's a good place to try and pick up, you know, if you're into grandmas, some gilfs. Like, that's the place to go. Um, were you making fun of friends? Yeah, you call me your friend. I'm not calling you my friend. If you have a girlfriend, go with her, <laughs> obviously. But I figured they already knew that. That was the given. Um, <laughs> uh, so check it out. Have some fun. Um, thrift safely, you know, wear protection. Um, obviously, gloves and Purell is what I mean by that. Uh, because it's a little sticky and stinky in there. Um, but obviously they wash all their clothes before they put them out there, right? Duh. Totally. That, that, that face says totally. <laughs> totally. Uh, totally, obviously. Oh, delicious. Okay, but yeah, thrifting. Go check it out. Uh, you can do it anywhere. It is free unless you buy something, in which case you're spending money, so it's no longer free. Uh, and that is the moral of the story. Um, that it's free unless you buy something.